the Malangara Catholic Church of the Extra Territorial Region of India (ETRI) is pleased to showcase a short documentary depicting its genesis from a modest beginning to an exponential growth. We now invite you to the triumphant journey of this community. Sit back, revive those euphoric moments, and more so, look forward to what unfolds for you and the community at large. Let us start with the hierarchical introduction of the Universal Catholic Church. His Holiness, Pope Benedict XVI, heads the Universal Church, which is primarily divided into two major rites, the Western and the Eastern rites. The Western Rite comprises of four major churches, whereas the Eastern Rite has 22 churches. The Siro Malangara community depicted under the Eastern Rite comes under the major Archiepiscopal Church. Closer home in India, we have the Catholic Church broadly divided into three main churches. The Roman Catholic Church, a direct offshoot of the Western Rite. Likewise, the Siro Malabar and Siro Malangara forms the Eastern Rites in India. The Siro Malangara Church, headed by Major Archbishop and Catholicos, more and more Basilios Klimis, anchors the community, which is a little over 5 lakh members spread across the globe. The Malangara Church has two major archdioceses in the form of Trivandrum and Trivella. The two other dioceses are at a proposal stage the extraterritorial region of India and the exarchate region of America and Europe. Now do a deep dive and look at the ETRI and its footprint. It all started way back in 1955 with Bethany Ashram setting its congregational base in the outskirts of the Pune cities in a small village called Ramwadi. The spiritual fathers within the ashram started the humble initiative of locating Malangarite spread across the length and the breadth of the vast city. If not, for the earnest zeal and efforts by the then spiritual fathers and the first generation Pune Malangarites, this would have been a task unaccomplished. This initiation has been well documented and is widely believed to be the genesis of the Bahia Kerala mission and the formation of the community at large. A decade later, 1965 to be precise, the Pune community with a reasonable growth standing got an endorsement from the local bishop of Pune diocese to celebrate the Malangara Holy Eucharist once a month in the Latin church. This we believe has been the trigger that sprouted across other states in the country. It was in 1989 the late Archbishop Benedict Mar Gregorius envisioned the concept of fellowship in the form of conventions. Initially, within the Mumbai Pune missions and subsequently the concept extended to other regions such as Chennai, Bhopal and Delhi. The annual convention has now become a regular feature of all Bahia Kerala missions. Likewise, the Bahia Kerala mission with Pune leading the way has also participated in a number of programs and events held in Kerala. All this and more bringing about the true ethos of a vibrant and a fellowship oriented community. The Pune Convention in 1997 holds a high prominence in the community growth as it was in this convention which witnessed the demand of a coordinator to help facilitate missions working outside of Kerala. It may be noted that the extra-territorial region of India nomenclature came into existence with the appointment of Reverend Father Dr. John Workman's OIC as coordinator of ETRI by the church hierarchy. The long-drawn ETRI dream for its own apostolic visitator was realized in the year 2007. ETRI got its first bishop as the apostolic visitator, our very own beloved Bishop Jacob Mar Barnabas. The appointment of the apostolic visitor of ETRI has been a blessing to the community and the periods thereof has seen the community grow leaps and bounds. The ETRI region represents 44 churches spread across 13 states and covers an excess of 10,000 members across the Bahia Kerala region. Mumbai. In the early 60s, Malangarites migrated to Mumbai and its neighboring cities. In those days, the Malangarites were under the jurisdiction of the local parish priests for their ecclesial needs. 
It was in 1974, with the blessings of the late Archbishop Benedict Mark Gregorius, that the Civil Malangara Association was formed in Mumbai, which was later registered as Malangara Catholic Association, and subsequently the first Malangara liturgy was celebrated in 1978. Today, the Mumbai sub-region boasts of four personal parishes and catering to the needs of nine sub-units with sustained help and services from the Bedini sisters. The Mumbai region also manages schools and other related mission activities. Nasik, Providence brought together the pioneers of the community in Nasik in 1993 and the desire to have an independent church of its own materialized in June 2002. Likewise, an ad hoc parish in Aurangabad and Nagpur was established in the year 2006. Since then, the small community has grown to its present stature in fellowship. Tamil Nadu The movement started way back in 1974 with the inaugural meeting conducted by His Grace Most Reverend Benedict Mar Gregorius and the local Archbishop in Chennai. With 190 families extending to 800 members, the Chennai congregation has grown in leaps and bounds. Services rendered by the Bedouin sisters has been another noteworthy point in enhancing the church through a number of institutions.